Hey everyone, welcome back. iOS 16 just released. I know many of you are excited about it, but some people their iPhones just won't update to iOS 16. You might be stuck on unable to verify update, unable to check for update, software update failed, and any other situation that I didn't mention. So in this video, I'll show you guys how to fix iPhone that won't update to iOS 16. Let's go. Before we start, you need to do some checking so that we won't waste our time doing something unnecessary. First, we need to make sure that your iPhone model is supported by the iOS version you tried to update. Check out this photo, you can see that iOS 16 is no longer supports iPhone models that older than iPhone 8. It's very unfortunate. If your iPhone model is not supported, then you are not able to update. Second, second, make sure your iPhone has a good network or Wi-Fi condition. Third, make sure your iPhone storage space is enough. Fourth, check Apple service status. It's not always your iPhone went wrong. It could be Apple service shut down when there are too many people trying to update. You can go to this website to check for it. If the options that link to update are off, then all you can do is wait for Apple to repair it. When you have no problem with these, update your iPhone again. If your iPhone still won't update, then you can try the method below. First method, hard reset iPhone. Sometimes hard reset iPhone will flash away the system bugs, so let's try it. For iPhone 8 or later models, press the volume up button and press the volume down button and press and hold the power button. Keep pressing till the Apple logo shows up. Then you can go check the update again. Second method, reset network settings. The network could be the reason cause iPhone won't update. You can try reset network settings, go to the settings page, tap general, scroll to the bottom tap transfer or reset iPhone. Choose reset, reset network settings. Wait for the reset process over, you can try to update again. Third method, delete and reinstall the iOS 16 update. If you're not receiving the iOS 16 update or have other issues, you can try to delete the iOS 16 update files. You can go to the iPhone storage page and look for the iOS 16 upgrade file, tap on it and delete it. Then go back to the check for update and download it again, see if it is working this time. Fourth method, update with a different way. If you're updating your iPhone in settings, you should try updating your iPhone with iTunes or Finder. Open your iTunes or Finder, connect your iPhone to it. Then click the check for update option, and then you can proceed with the update. It should be easy. But usually, iTunes will take a long, long time to download and update. So I recommend you re-iboot. All you need to do is install it, connect your iPhone to it. Click the green start button. Choose standard repair. Download the firmware. Start the process. And it will update your iPhone to iOS 16 very soon. You can check the download link in the description and download it. Fifth method, factory reset iPhone. If the above method is not working, then you can try to factory reset your iPhone. But before we do it, you should back up your iPhone. You can back up your iPhone through iCloud or iTunes is up to you. When you finish backup, then we can start to factory reset iPhone. Go to the settings page, tap general, scroll to the bottom tap transfer or reset iPhone option, choose erase all content and settings. Then your iPhone will begin the factory reset process. Wait for it complete. Then go to iTunes or Finder to restore your backup. Once the restore is finished, you can go to update your iPhone to iOS 16 again. Sixth method, get Apple support. If all the method is not working on your iPhone, then the last thing you can do is look for Apple support. It could be your iPhone hardware went wrong. You should leave it to the Apple guy to handle it. That's it. Hope this video is helpful to you. I'll be grateful if you subscribe. See you next time.